a brilliant inventor. The goal? To create the greatest webtoon of all time. They failed. Now witness the failure! Bonus stage! We've got to find out who evil is. If it's Ellie, spankings are in order. With this. Can we talk alone, Phil? Seriously? I have some concerns. Concern yourself with my fist! <laughs> Joe, what the hell is wrong with you? What? Everyone's a fair target for violence. Besides, you were doing stupid crap to them last week. When I do it, it's zany. When you do it, it just feels wrong, like eating a baby. Yeah, like chocolate and whipped cream. I've got to get out of this meaningless limbo, surrounded by TV show archetypes and questionable storylines. You know, Raya, there is a way to escape the virtual world. What's that, girl who claims she's not a robot but pretended to be like one in earlier episodes for sympathy? Mind if I smoke? Now, if you are human, you could exit out of one of several escape doors built around the city. They were put there in the event of a blackout or system failure so Joel could perform maintenance. But who could make me a human? Nobody. I just wanted to give you a fleeting dream. Oh, Snizzle. I've just been riot. Sorry for suddenly disappearing conveniently during that other conversation that was just going on, thus holding our current conversation, which can now resume. Dude, where have you been? We absolutely cannot get sidetracked. Okay, seriously, we can't get sidetracked. Picnic time! Picnic time? Picnic time? Which jar of peanut butter should we bring? Let's bring them all! I need your help, George Lucas. You're some sort of final opportunity. Greetings, um, I'm quaint to meet your pleasure. I mean, pleasure to... I... I want you to become my Twi'lekian princess. What? Sorry, lonely nights at Skywalker Ranch. I'm not sure you'd be able to handle my spiky genitals of death. I love a good challenge. Anyway, what can I do you for? First of all, who names their studio after a fictional space farm? Second, I need to become a woman. A real one, not this horrible mess of metal and corpse flesh that binds me to serving out goth girl one-liners every week. I'm afraid that's out of my area of expertise, uh, but I'm still available for that opening. Um, in your pants. It's been filled with burrowing termites. Please teach me to love. Evil's back? That scallion rapper? Yeah, well, I mean, you're it, so I would think you'd know. I'm not evil. I'm a delicate waif. A vanilla waif. Look, denial is hurtful. It sure hurt me when I was in high school. I'll show everyone. I'll get a real job and get away from that obnoxious friend of mine. I don't want to allow my mother to be transformed by one of his experiments to be romanced. What a strangely specific pledge. Wait, I went to high school during bonus stage? Phil, I swear, evil is someone else. I'm over doing rotten things to people. It was just a phase. I believe you. Any other phases you're over? Well, I'm not over hitting on people. Ow! I see you're being little. Ow! Yes, I understand. Ow! Great, now I can't see colors. Ow! My name is Barbara. That's just great. Yo! I'll never get out of here. I heard you want to become human. So human that you're too human. For Xbox 360. What a hilarious joke. You'll fit in with the other pop culture zombies that starve themselves on the brain matter of Hollywood. Don't count me out too soon. I found a few toys in Joel's laboratory. What in the world of Brett Favre is this? A small sampler. Just let me install this chip and you'll get everything that's coming to you. That sounds vaguely threatening. Don't think about that. Think about all the carnage you'll be able to inflict in the real world. I don't want to inflict carnage. I just want to live a real life and meet people with more than one obvious dimension to them. Are you saying there are gimmicky one-trick pony characters in bonus stage? I'm crazy. I'm fine. I'm... I'm a weasel. I'm big fat guy. Well, I got no leads. I have a few theories, but most of them involve this toaster. Just look at it. Calculating. Controlled. A lone gunman of fury. Ah, the machines are rising up against us! How are you, gentlemen? Well, we get signal. Who are you? I'm the last thing you'll ever see. What is this thing? Bill? 
Uh, are you okay? I am the bacon and bring all the pork again to all the little kids down the row. Clogging the rotaries with honey and cheese and they'll all die at the age of eight. Who knew that near-death delirium could be so catchy? I feel I should warn you. Even though Joel and Phil are human, they're still just virtual manifestations here. You'd be the first real human in a simulated environment. And I should warn you that no one has ever really listened to a word you've said, and that tradition is not about to be broken. Does anyone have a rubber band? Because, oh snap! Ow! Keep this up and I am seriously going to tell an IR cop to K-line you. You fight well. Killing you two would be too honorable. There's no fun in a mercy killing. What if I were to throw the Your Mom card onto the table? Possibly with a so dumb stat booster. Wow, she looks exactly the same. When you dream about something happening, then when it actually happens, you feel awful about it. Except not really. Please, Phil, I'm having a moment. Holy crap, that dove is a gun! Well, now we have several threats to worry about. Evil, this new guy, and the ongoing threat of rising gas prices. Am I right? CNN wouldn't lie to me. Is it really right to go out with jokes? I mean, Raya just died. For real. Well, I don't know. Let's ask Johnny the Answer Boy. Johnny the Answer Boy says... Suck my tit! 